Michaela Barnes. And welcome back to your daily video announcements. Today for lunch, we have biscuits and gravy, beef sticks, tri taters, scrambled eggs, juice blend, mandarin oranges, and a cold milk. Let's take a look at today's holidays. Let's take a quick glance at your top five news stories of the day. Hello, I'm Byron, and these are your top five news stories of the day. Number one, Congress is currently gridlocked on recent gun control measures. Number two, fresh protests are still occurring and does not seem to slow down anytime soon. Number three, Newland has canceled their public schools for today due to a cyber attack. Number four, Apple is embracing installment payments for devices. And five, there will be a color guard meeting scheduled for April 5th and an advisory during the, in the band room. Here's our word of the week. Word of the week. This week's word of the week is pragmatic. Dealing with things sensible and realistically in a way that is based on practical rather than theoretical considerations. Here's an interview about happiness. Okay. Hi, I'm Susan Morales, and this is... Brianna. Uh, the, today I'm going to be asking you, what's your definition of happiness? Music and reading. Good. Thank you. My name is Logan Walk, and my definition of happiness is sports. Uh, my name is Crisanto De La Rosa. Uh, my definition of happiness is being with your friends, just being yourself. My definition of happiness is when dopamine is released from the brain and you feel happy. Next year is a senior artwork announcement. Here's a senior night announcement. Here's a career fair announcement. Here's a color guard announcement. You may be wondering, what is color guard? Known also as a sport of the arts, color guard is the use of flags, sabers, rifles, and other equipment, as well as dance and other interpretive movement. We use these equipments and movements in order to enhance the visual effect of a show. Typically, color guard often occurs between the summer and fall months, with most guards performing alongside their school's marching band with live music and a field show on a football field. On the flip side, winter guard occurs between the winter and spring months. It is often performed in a gym to played back music, and it is a standalone activity separate from the band. Many color guards perform for fun at rallies, football games, and parades but many also compete competitively, participating in competitions, tournaments, and field shows. Should you join Color Guard? Yes, if you want a team-based sport that challenges you both mentally and physically, lifelong friendships, fun competitions, and lasting memories, then Color Guard is the sport for you. Here's a prom announcement. Prom tickets are now on sale. Valley Center Junior Class and Prom Committee presents Prom 2023, Claire de Lune. BCH juniors and seniors, purchase your prom tickets through the My School Dance app. Tickets are now on sale through Tuesday, April 11th at 9 p.m. Hope to see you all there. Let's head over to the weather. I'm Natalie. I'm Macy. Today's high is 80 degrees. And today's low is 56 degrees. Now for a quick class pass, let's wrap up with the state history. Stay classy, BC. April 3rd, 1968. In Memphis, Tennessee, civil rights leader Martin Luther King Jr. gives this speech on the night before his assassination. We've got some difficult days ahead. But it really doesn't matter with me now because I've been to the mountaintop. 1936, Bruno Richard Hauptmann is electrocuted in Trenton, New Jersey for the kidnap and murder of aviator Charles Lindbergh's infant son. 1948, President Harry Truman signs the Marshall Plan the aid package helps European allies rebuild after World War II and resist communism. 1882, Jesse James, the notorious Wild West outlaw, is shot to death in St. Joseph, Missouri. Robert Ford, a member of the James Gang, pulls the trigger. James' brother Frank surrenders months later. 1860, another iconic chapter from America's Wild West years. The legendary Pony Express begins service between St. Joseph, Missouri and Sacramento, California. And 1924. Hey, Stella! Hey, Stella! 
Actor Marlon Brando was born in Omaha, Nebraska. Among his movie credits, A Streetcar Named Desire, On the Waterfront, and The Godfather. Today in History, April 3rd, Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.